Hello everyone, and welcome back to our channel. Today, we are diving deep into an intriguing topic that has been the subject of much speculation and anticipation, the Iraqi dinar revaluation, often referred to as the RV. For those who have been following the developments in Iraq's financial landscape, you might be familiar with the discussions surrounding this event. One prominent voice in this conversation is the Intel guru MNT Goat, who recently shared some insights that we will be expanding upon today. MNT Goat emphasized that many people are eager to understand what exactly is causing the delay in the RV. However, according to MNT Goat, there isn't a specific holdup. Instead, it's more about allowing the process to unfold naturally. The revaluation of the Iraqi dinar is not something that can be rushed. It's part of a larger plan that requires careful execution and patience. This plan, often attributed to Dr. Sinan al-Shabibi, the former governor of the Central Bank of Iraq, CBI, outlines a meticulous roadmap for Iraq's economic revitalization. Dr. Shabibi's plan, crafted back in 2011, was designed to stabilize and strengthen Iraq's economy. The plan involves various phases, each addressing different aspects of economic reform and currency stabilization. One of the key points MNT Goat makes is that despite the numerous challenges and deviations Iraq has faced, they always find their way back to Dr. Shabibi's foundational plan. This resilience is crucial because it signifies a commitment to achieving long-term economic sovereignty and stability. The journey towards the RV is dotted with stumbling blocks, political instability, economic fluctuations, and regional conflicts have all played roles in delaying the process. However, these obstacles are not seen as permanent roadblocks, but rather as temporary challenges that Iraq must navigate. It's important to understand that economic reforms of this magnitude are complex and require a stable environment to be effective. This is why patience and a long-term perspective are essential. MNT GOAT also highlights the significance of the reinstatement of the Iraqi dinar. This reinstatement is more than just a financial adjustment. It's a critical step for Iraq to regain its national sovereignty. The value of a nation's currency is a reflection of its economic health and stability. For Iraq, revaluing the dinar would signal a significant milestone in its recovery and growth. It would mean that Iraq has reached a point where its economy can sustain and benefit from a stronger currency. The anticipation surrounding the RV is understandable. For many investors and Iraqi citizens, the revaluation represents hope for a more prosperous future. It promises potential economic benefits that could improve living standards and foster greater economic development. However, it's essential to manage expectations and understand that such a significant economic shift doesn't happen overnight. In conclusion, while the process may seem slow and fraught with obstacles, it's important to recognize that these are part of the natural progression towards a stable and robust economy. The plan laid out by Dr. Shabibi remains a guiding light for Iraq's financial future. As MNT Goat aptly points out, the reinstatement of the Iraqi dinar is not just a financial maneuver, but a pivotal step towards regaining national sovereignty and economic independence. By allowing the process to play out and supporting the necessary reforms, we can look forward to a brighter economic future for Iraq. Thank you for watching. If you found this video informative, please like and subscribe to our channel for more insights and updates. Until next time. Stay informed and stay hopeful.